Why don't we just lift our hands to God? Because there's no substitute for His presence. And you say, why do you lift your hands? It's a good question. It's just an act of surrender to God. Just going, hey, I need you. I'm reaching out to Him. And other than that, the Bible says to do it. So let's just do it. Father, we thank you tonight. Lord, there's no substitute for who you are. And there's no substitute for your presence. Lord, we thank you tonight. The Bible says that in the presence of the Lord, there is the fullness of joy. So Lord, tonight we rejoice in you. We say thank you for all that you've done in our lives. And all that you're doing in our lives. Father, we thank you tonight. We pray for every person present. They may have a touch of heaven on their life tonight. And go home changed by the power and the glory of Jesus tonight. We thank you, Father. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Come on, sing. Man, this morning we had so many of these prayer requests. It's awesome. People thanking God for so many different things. And that's cool. It's good to thank God for stuff. I wonder how many prayers we've prayed and we've forgotten that He answered them. <laughs> you haven't gone months, maybe years, and then suddenly went, hang on a sec. That got answered 18 months ago, and I even forgot to say thanks for what I asked that you did it, and then. You're going to say thankful in the heart. That's why people put in all types of things of thanking God for people, thanking for a great week and opportunity to bless people and see increase in their lives.